But before I got into lifting weights, my one big obsession was playing guitar. I had uh, two electric guitars, an acoustic guitar, and a bass. Uh, I was going to be Slash without the top hat or the cigarette dangling from my mouth. And my first guitar teacher, Jean-Marc, he taught me the pentatonic scale, and he taught me a lot of other scales, both major and minor, and he made me practice each one literally hundreds of times until they were hardwired into my brain. And uh, I remember really resisting at first because, you know, running scales felt repetitive and boring, a little bit like homework. And I'd be like, you know, I don't want to learn scales again. I want to play some ACDC. And even though I could crank out a decent version of Back in Black, I'd really hear it from Jean-Marc if I didn't practice my scales. Because he knew if I mastered the basics, then I could play anything. And he was right. You know, I went on to win awards for both rock and classical performances. I was voted uh, best in music at my high school graduation. Now, when I started coaching people on nutrition, I figured out that the process was very much the same. The number one complaint I would get would be not enough variety. But really, until you establish the habits that are the foundation of your success, uh, narrowing it to one to three options for each meal is really the way to go because it simplifies everything. Meal prep, grocery shopping, you learn to identify portion sizes, you figure out what foods you like that also work well with your plan. And uh, pretty soon you identify a system that works well for you, but it's also easy to stick to. Now people always want new or different because that's what's exciting, you know? But when you really start to break it down, success is very routine and boring. It's mechanical, you know? It's about doing the basics well and doing them very repetitively. And in my experience, the people who uh, insist on a lot of variety from the word go rarely achieve the consistency that they need to, to really make the right nutrition a habit. But once you learn the basics, trying new things becomes second nature. Does that make sense? You're really just expanding your repertoire at that point. Now for me, once I had every scale known to music at my fingertips, not only could I deliver ACDC with a lot more accuracy, but I could really pull off any new musical genre I felt like. And if I hadn't invested the time to get my reps in, so to speak, and do basic scales over and over again, I never would have accomplished most of what I did as a musician. So get your reps in too, you know, learn the basics of whatever you want to be good at and do it a thousand times over. Stick with straightforward, simple and repetitive until you get it right. And then once you master the basics, branching out is a logical next step that you can take without compromising your results. Anyway, that's all for today. Thanks very much for watching. Uh, be sure to visit my website at connorkelly.com for much, much more. And until next time, happy transforming.